Hi there. In this short lecture, we will learn about move and copy files from your file explorer so that copying and moving items from one place to another place to organize your storage drive can be done and this is where key to getting your files organized. So let's begin. So if I would like to you know, go to my file explorer and then go to my documents, I have a couple of folders and files within this folder and within this I also have some folder called photos and there are a couple of photos are available within this folder and if I just if I want to you know, go back I can see here projects this project folder has audios and English and the movies and there are some of uh, files called educational files also now let's give it a try to copy paste first thing so if I want to copy a sub project folder as it is I can do by right click and then you would you know get it here option or if you just select it also you get this navigation um, when you select it actually in the toolbar you get this option for copying and cut and also you can rename this and you could also share this folder uh, or you could delete the file also so in my case if I just right click and if I click on more show more options I get an option here copy cut so I can perform any of this action in case if I click on a copy it makes a duplicate copy of as it is the file so that I'll have the same file in another location I can paste it so let's say if I copy example English if I just copy here this file folder uh, to maybe an audio I'll simply come here and paste it so that one more English folder can be created I'll say just simply more options paste it so the another folder called English got created here right this is called copy paste but moving is different let's say I want to completely move this file from audio to a new folder so let's create a new folder let's say I want to create a new folder called media files and then hit enter so that the media files got created now choose your uh, in your keyboard press control key to select multiple files for example I can select your audio by holding the control key education files and the movies and then I can slowly hold this key with the mouse control key and move or I could you know use a copy so here there's a you know if if I, if you see here there's an option called move sometimes it is changing to copy also see so the reason is if you remove the if you hold the control key it actually copies the selected files uh, wherever you're drop uh, dragging and dropping and if you remove the control key it actually moves means the files gets completely moved from this location so let's give it a try with first move option let's say inside media files I want this audio file to be moved so what I can do is I can I can simply without pressing any key within the keyboard since it's a single file I can just drag with the mouse by holding the left key to media file so the file a folder called audio gets moved to media files right now if I go back now this time I want it uh, English as well as the educational files to be moved automatically so what I can do is I can hold a shift key like this and click wherever you want for example I want chill English so two files in between wherever you are clicking for example if I click here okay all the files from the the first to last whatever you have selected with the shift key gets automatically selected okay and for example I want uh, set for two uh, sub projects till this I want to select it so instead of you click one by one press the shift key and where do you want you know I want till sub so projects so I can sh simply click here by holding the shift key so in between these things got selected so shift or control key will help you to you know select it the major difference between shift and control key for the selection would be if you click on shift it continuously select until you uh, 
second time click on it for example if I first click here over the set four and till the sub project I can select it automatically all the files uh, by holding the shift key and later point if I want I can simply move like this by uh, without pressing any key in the keyboard or I can copy them by holding a control key so when I press a control key it makes a copy of the files and also inside the uh, media files for example if I just you know click here media files it just makes these two four five different folders so if I just click on here media now there are five different files or folders got created within this so this is how you could actually create a copy of file by pressing a control key and selecting for the shift key what if if I want you know move them all of these files to somewhere you could do it by pressing control key simply uh, this is gonna move it right but if you remove the control key it will move but if you press the control key on your keyboard it actually copies a folder to English right so I'm not pressing control key I'm simply moving to English folder example so everything would move directly here now there could be uh, a possible case I don't want to move everything to the same folder but I want to do it in another folder called C colon uh, maybe a temp directory so for example if I just open C drive I have here a uh, folder called maybe example I'm, I'm gonna create here a folder example uh, temp folder example okay this is a test uh, temporary folder which I'm uh, getting created here now I want some files to be you know, copied for example from my documents I want my project file to be copied to temp folder how would I do it so for that what you can do is you can simply you know make your window to smaller or bigger and open up one more explorer so you can open multiple windows explorers or the file explorer can be open now let's navigate to this PC and C drive and temp folder now from here you go to your source folder uh, so in my case it is in a document and let's say I want to move all the uh, photos so simply I can select everything by control A so that everything gets selected or I can you know better way to you know view it would be the details and I can press shift key until end I can click on the mouse so that by holding shift key it selects everything now it's time for me either if I press a control key it's gonna copy right if I remove control key the action performs as move so let's click on move so the files get moved directly from here to here so this is how you could do it so you got this small warning because actually these documents are getting synced up from one drive all of a sudden it got disappeared so uh, do you really want to you know, delete it yes I can you know delete it I don't want to show up this so I can you know take it up but this might not come up for you as a window if you move it from outside of one drive okay so this is how you can move and if I want you know copy back move, move back to my photos I can simply select all of them and then hold control key to copy or if you don't want a uh, control key simply remove so that it gets moved this is how you can you know do the move and of course these are some of the core options that you have for copying and moving files of course there are other ways to do this but these are the most common options that i can talk about it within this short lecture